One of you will be strong. Not again. Yeah, you teaches. I know you are in pain. The Lord giveth and the Lord taketh, huh? You're not the only one to be tested. Did you know that I had a wife? So beautiful, isn't she? We were pregnant with our first child. And we were just babies ourselves, really. And I was terrified. I'm becoming a father, mostly about money. She wasn't worried. She had faith that things were going to work out. She always had faith. And one day, she was going to go visit a friend. Hmm. There was an accident. The Lord take it. They rushed me to a hospital and put me in a room with this little pink bundle stuffed with tubes. And they said that I had to be strong because my little girl was going to live. God was looking out for our daughter. And they left me in a, alone in the room with her. I just stared at my daughter, so helpless and so innocent. And all she had in the world was me, or nobody from nowhere was fuck. And in that moment, I knew that God was testing me. He was laying out a path before me, and all I had to do was choose. So I put my hand on my little girl's head, and I leaned in and I could smell her. And we prayed together, prayed for wisdom, prayed for strength. plan for me. I took my fingers and I put them on that little plastic tube that was taped to her angelic face and I pinched it shut. Mm. And after a little while her legs began to kick and kick. And then nothing. Stillness. Release. The Lord giveth, and the Lord take. Pain, sacrifice, these are all part of his test. And we have to prove that we can serve God, no matter what he asks. You've done well. This again? Excellent. Speed run this time, guys. Flipping hot. Call the herd. Three, one, kill, sacrifice. 
Go, 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 go. Good. Call the herd. Who's the final target? <laughs> there we go. Perfect. <laughs> Sorry for the sniffles, guys. No pre apologize but i just want to thank you for tuning in episode 31 of far cry 5 i'm sorry i had to start on a cutscene, but and that's why i couldn't introduce the video properly but nevertheless thank you so much for tuning in i love you guys don't forget to drop that, the like on this video show me some support show the channel some support we're still small but we're still a growing channel at the end of the day i've got a lot of stuff in the pipeline and once again i do thank you so much we must be strong Right, we seem to be okay right now, right? Um, I want to be getting up there, right? I think we want to be going up here. I think we've got to save the hostages. I was out thinking killing your buddy was a bad. I mean, shit, look at us. We're a devil's drop. Don't! Don't do it! I got a daughter! Oh, that's sweet. You'll have a couple seconds to remember on your way down. Let's do on that for a bit. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> right, we're okay, we're okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, nutted him. Love that, these animations. I was on fire, but I didn't want to get caught out there. This guy's on a turret. Wow, the animations are real cool. Right, we've got one here to release. Let's do it. There we go, secure Hawkeye Tunnel. Not a problem. Alright, any more? Oh. No, there is not. Everyone's accounted for. That's the white tail waved up. Helping us take care of our own is gonna have a big impact on morale. Maybe even get some more folks to join up, too. Shit. I knew Tammy was wrong about you. Congratulations. You're one of us now. If you got time, I got more work. Wow, that was close. Come see me in the wolf stand when you're ready. You gotta loot them, right? How? Deputy, I gotta tell you, some of the white tail called the chosen to hunt me down in planes. They're sure now. Not because of anything I ah. said. That's Action cool. Than words. People are coming from all over to join the white tails. You're giving them hope again. That's real That's cool, been a guys. Long time coming. Yeah. A long time. However, we did not want the flamethrower right now. Can't grab that little book. What else we got? I'm not sure what the flares are for. Uh, we've got main quest over there. Ellie Palmer is the quest. Uh, I'm not too sure what she'll want us to do, so we'll fast travel over there real quick. Let's see what they've got in store for us over there. Right, we're here. So, quest is here. Got a job for you. You remember the Grand View Hotel? That shithole we pulled you out of? Need you to head back there. Jacob nabbed a whitetail by the name of Briggs, and he's using the same brain-melting nonsense he tried on you. All in the hopes that Briggs will give up the wolf stand. I don't think our boy can hold out as long as you did. 
And if he gives up our location, we're done. So we gotta move on this quick. Some folks here think the smart move would be just to offer him. But if we start killing our own to save our asses, how's that make us any better than Jacob? Nah, I ain't going down that road. Here's what we're gonna do instead. Wheaties cooked up a little deprogramming package. Same thing we used on you. Need you to swap out the tape they got running in Briggs' room with the one I'm gonna give you. And then, well, then we'll see what happens. If everything goes smooth, our guy comes back to Earth, doesn't, well, we'll deal with that when the time comes. All right, get free. Another one here. What is going on here? I wasn't sure you'd come back, but I guess you're full of surprises. This squealer here ran security up at the chalet. Lucky for us, he wasn't that good at his job and wound up in my kiddie pool. Seems the place is being used as a training ground for the Chosen. If you've seen them in action, you know how ruthless they are. You know what Jacob taught him to use for target practice? Live bodies. Gets their first kill jitters out of the way. These motherfuckers don't value any life that ain't in their cult. And they need to be put down like the dogs they are. So you're gonna head up to that chalet. You're gonna kill every Chosen you see, and you're gonna rig that building with explosives. And then, we're gonna watch that whole fucking place turn into a smoldering heap of ash. Sound good to you? Everyone here is on the Alright, eviction notice. That's another quest. Sweet. We're absolutely raking him in, which is what we want to be doing. Hey, you got a sec? Heard Tammy's plan came together. Thanks for clearing up the airwaves. Now we can get folks organized and, more importantly, get some good tunes cranking through these mountains. Unfortunately, my setup can only handle vinyl, so the selection's a little limited at the moment. But the folks. Oh, what? I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> hey, need a word. Always gotta have the right. Tool. Okay, here's the deal. Unfortunately, my setup can only handle vinyl, so the selection's a little limited at the moment. But the folks around here have pretty decent taste. So, if you happen to come across any albums, toss them my way. Cool? Alright, turn the table. Side mission also. Plenty of stuff to be getting on with. Collect first set of vinyl crates. One. Um, so, yeah, ma the main storyline quest now is just like over here. Can't really do the better arms just at the minute. There is an eviction notice one here of reaching the Stone Ridge Chalet, which Yo, is right near Bruce. So we will do that. We will do that. Right, once again, this baby is here for us. This helicopter was the best purchase I have made in this game so far. Um, right, 900 meters this way. Let's do it. Got full rockets again. We've just rebought her, unless I just paid for him by accident, and for that I will hate myself if I did. I think that was my last K if it was. Alright. Switch weapons so I'm not tempted to use any by accident. Fiction notice. Let's just read the quest. Go to Eden's Gate training grounds at Stone Ridge Chalet and eliminate the Chosen before... No, uh, eliminate what, sorry? Eliminate the Chosen there before blowing it up. Okay. So the chosen are the people that are set on us by Joseph or the father okay, in the plains. Eli here. Got you on the cameras. Grandview's a straight shot north of there. Get moving. Kill the chosen. How do you know who the chosen are? There's choppers in the area. Place is a goddamn fortress. The place is a fortress, so let's spice things up and do this stealthily. However, landing a helicopter right in their front garden is not stealthily at all. He's chosen, right? Yep. So they look like that then, they look different to the rest. Now I want to try and take them down by melee. Basic survival. That's when we were at our best. You see, the world has become soft. Weak. We've sheltered ourselves 
from every Going down. obstacle, danger, and fear. Slowly gonna make my way through. Oh, just Ranzo, that's not slow. Careful, they're around here somewhere. We're no longer hungry, thirsty, or cold. We're no longer alive. Well, this is a solution. Both of them. <laughs> oh wow! Fuck! Finishes with fireworks. I forgot we got to blow the area up, right? Whoa! All right, that's him taken care of. And him. Rocks. That's one planted. Plant IED in the. <laughs> Plant an IED in the basement. <laughs> God damn it, man. Helicopter in the area, like they said. Oh, should surely I should do him. Neck crack when you break the neck is insane. How do you get down then to the cellar underneath the house, maybe like this? There we go. Slowly make our way through. There's a lot of boots here, guys. Jeez. Uniform area, right? We've right, got 15 there. seconds to get out. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh, there's two helicopters. Woo! Holy crap. Get down. Uh -oh. Understand something, Deb. No one comes back from Jacob's chair the same. I've seen it firsthand. You go in one way, and you come out another. Eli One down. Two down. Killed him through the smoke as well. What a shot. Alright, my helicopter's just over here. Fiction notice. Hell yeah. God, look at that. We're nearly at the end, guys. We are nearly at the end of Jacob's area already. Right, our helicopter's here. Let's go. Alright, so now, is there any more main in area? That's doctor's orders, so that's not what we're wanting. Get free. That's what we're wanting. That is listed what we're wanting. Main storyline quest pushes along that bar. Two thousand meters out, do it. All right, just hitting a hallucinogenic area again or something. God knows what happened to me. I've tripped out. Oh, you must be hungry. <laughs> Did you know it takes 10 days for civilization to collapse? Yeah. You take away a man's basic needs and he will revert to his primordial instincts in just 10 days. <laughs> That's a difficult thing to understand unless you've lived it. You know, I was in Iraq during the first Gulf War. 82nd Airborne, all Americans, hoorah! <laughs> One night there was a an ambush at 
Me and this guy named Miller got separated from the unit. No food. No radio. Nearest base, 200 clicks to the south, so we just started walking. Well, by the third day, I knew we were lost. Day six, ran out of water. You know what that's like, don't you? Difficult to swallow. On the seventh day, Miller's legs started going all wonky. Did you know your brain starts to eat your muscles in order to survive? That's why you're so goddamn skinny. And by the eighth day, the wolves were closing in. And I looked at Miller and I could tell we were as good as dead. And I accepted that. And in that acceptance, came clarity. You see, I wasn't just looking at Miller. I was looking at an opportunity. And it wasn't something I wanted. It was something that I had to do. It was... It was my test. You see, Miller's sacrifice wasn't about me walking out of that desert. It was about bringing me here. The weak have their purpose. You'll understand that soon enough. This again? Just go, just go, just go, just go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Oh. Oh, no. Grab the gun, grab the gun. I'm out of ammo, right? You are weak. I've got to start it again because I died. Holy crap. I think it's the best idea to pick up all the guns on the way. Get all the guns we can on the way. Plenty of time, 50 seconds, 7 seconds, perfect. Even more seconds left there, a minute now. Alright. Not bad, he says. It's a good, it's a good compliment.
That's it. You're a warrior. Make your sacrifice! There we go. Perfect. Wake up. Wake up. Open your eyes. Wake up. Rock. I'm gonna get you out of here, okay? And we're gonna get out of here, okay? Only you. Only you. Hey, what about me? What about me? You aren't strong enough. You have to get out of here before it starts again. Follow me. He knows you're ready. Got it all planned out. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Then he's got you. It becomes second nature routine. He gets in your head. And you don't even realize it. You can't ever go back. You understand? You can't ever go back. Come on. Truck. It's almost time. I've studied the route for weeks. It's the only way out. You'll be safe if you don't. They're gone. Find them. That's an order. Search everywhere. Move. Let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. Not yet. Not yet. Oh, fuck. Fuck. No. He pushed us onto the top of the truck. I don't know where you've gone and disappeared to, but shit. We really kicked the hornet's nest. I know you're probably out there trying to get your friend Pratt back, but us whitetails could still use a hand. Right. Anyways, you know where to find us. We're we living two personalities here or something. I'm not kind of down with that, but the right to bear arms not too far off. But guys, I'm going to leave that here for now. Alright, I'm sorry for the weird cut, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen. But we're back again. Hunk Drew Drubman, I think it's called. Oh, here. It's my new campaign manager. Got a new job for you. Do you know what gerrymandering is? Of course you don't. You're a regular American, just like... What the... F Who's letting shots off? What happened there, brother? Now, look here. It's my new campaign manager. Knew you had some sense. So, got a new job for you. Do you know what gerrymandering is? Of course you don't. You're a regular American, just like me. It's boring egghead stuff involving redrawn voting districts, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, the election's coming up. And them eggheads tell me I'm fucked in the polls because those goddamn Peggy's ain't gonna be voting for me. Say what you will about lunatic cult movements, but the bottom line is they vote. Now, the eggheads say the only chance I got at winning would be to go back in time and gerrymander them district lines so the Peggy's ain't counted. And that got me to thinking 
I could just as easily win if them Peggy's just didn't show up to vote. Now, I'm not telling you how to go about such a thing, wink, wink, but a permanent solution to my temporary problem would work best if you catch my meaning. Obviously, I'm not saying to murder anyone because that's still illegal. It is still technically illegal, right? But if there were less Peggy's around because they somehow tripped and fell on several dozens of bullets, it would probably help my chances. The district in question is up at the crossroads by the Grill Street Diner. You could take my idiot son with you. He's not good at much, but he can shoot okay. And you know, if this were ever to blow back on us, it would be good to have Patsy. I don't even think he'd get jail time on account of him being a little touched. Well, what you waiting for? Get moving. I thought I could hear something behind me. All right. Make hope great again. New quest accepted. We're nearly, nearly at the point where we can be taking on Jacob, guys. So, where is that what it is? Yes, it is. Let's go extreme voter. So, let's head on down. I might go pick this up from Dr. Sarah Perkins first. Just so we've got another one. Alright, let's do that. Holy crap, what is going on? I've got another ready here. What the heck is going on out here? Oh! You had a rocket launcher, man. Go, go, go! We're suppressing fire, but. They're suppressing fire, should I say? No. We're gone. We're gone. We're good. We are okay for now. Coming up on this fast. Oh Show us over here. Holy! Watch out! Get back! Back! Oh, thank God! Thank God they She's got wolves on her. Please! I need your help! Um. Did that take two shots off me already? Or am I not hitting it? I can't be hitting it, right? There we go. Looks like... There's a few of them here. Damn it. You're a survivor. Sweet. Alright. There we go. Let's... Where's the other body? Uh -huh. There she is. What's going on here, woman? What we got? What we got for me? This forest is a death trap. Okay. Check what that is here. What's this? Vinyl crate. I had to bury Bailey today. The bite must have nicked an artery or something. She lost so much blood. I was with her and in the end I was there holding her hand and then she was gone. I know I'm not much of a soldier, but I'm not going to let their deaths be in vain. I might not be good with a gun, but I can help Eli and his white tails another way. I'm going to science the shit out of these. What did Eli call them? Question mark. Judges? With the right data. I can make a difference. All these deaths won't be won't be for nothing. You motherfuckers aren't gonna get away with this. <sighs> Shit, I didn't think I was gonna make it. Thanks for that. I'm Sarah, by the way, Sarah Perkins. Was heading up a wildlife conservation team studying the wolves in the park, and then, well, we found these things. <sighs> They're wolves, but not like anything I've seen before. The cult calls them judges. Bigger, stronger, tougher than the other species around here. The cult tried to force my team to help him. When we said no, they sicked those things on us. Eli and the Whitetails got me out. Been trying to pay them back ever since. I've got a theory on how to use the cult's formula to help us track these creatures. But all I'm working with is corpses. I need a live judge. I know it's a big ask, but I'm desperate. The cult's training him at an old youth camp called the Breakthrough. 
do this for me, and I might be able to put something together that'll help you hunt these things. I'll meet you at the camp once it's clear. Alright, dinner time also accepted. So we've got a bunch of new quests to be doing. We've actually got loads of stuff to be doing over here. As you can see, that is what we're working towards, the father. So we've took out two of his heralds, also known as his brothers and sister. Sorry if you can hear the mic crackle there, guys. I really do apologise for that. But, make hope great again. Reach the crossroads is where the closest one is for now. So, there's no helicopter access here. We're going to head down. Holy crap. Someone's shooting at me. Time to go. They're all over there. I think they're real annoyed now. I've been taking down their areas. Civilians. Sharp right coming up. Sweet. Looks like there's gas ahead. It's not good. Golden Valley. That's what's chasing me then. They're having an aerial fight. They're having a dog fight. What is going on around these parts? Everything's going crazy. But in the next couple of episodes, guys, make sure you show the channel some love. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you have been tuning in, let's secure the crossroads though real quick. And in the next few episodes, Far Cry 5 might just be coming to an end. As we are two heralds out of the three. And then we've just Joseph left to do. Alright. Secure the crossroads, which means that we will be hostiles in the area. There you go, I can hear him. There's one. On a gun. Two, three. Three out of four. Sweet. They're down. We're good. Crossword secured, ladies and gentlemen. This is the more of that biohazard stuff. Hold them off, ladies. I hear liberals and Canadians are also huh? pretty clumsy. And oh. not voting for me, but no pressure. This turret is absolutely awesome. Woo! Fun way of doing it. Make hope great again. Shall we get all the loot? Tell you what, is that you take old Nancy, blowing up right? You go around cleaning up this county in that truck, and all them prospective voters will know who's got the Oh, and please don't bring her junior back. Let's go back and get. Can you guys hear that? Oh. Alright ladies and gentlemen, I hope you did enjoy this episode of Far Cry 5 walkthrough. Thank you so much for all the recent support.
I love you guys. I've been different content. Make sure you check out the next episode or the next couple of episodes and see how this game ends. We're getting there, ladies and gentlemen. We are. I love you. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.